Welcome back to Faith, Family, and Funny Reviews. If you're new here on this channel, I share with you delightful, family-friendly, and faith-based movies and television shows. So we're going to go ahead and get started with our special feature today, which is titled The Shack. You guys should find this film streaming right now on different platforms. But first, let me tell y'all what this film is about. After suffering a family tragedy, Matt spirals into a deep depression that causes him to question his innermost beliefs. Facing a crisis of faith, he receives a mysterious letter urging him to an abandoned shack in the Oregon wilderness. Despite his doubts, Matt journeys to the shack and encounters a trio of strangers led by a woman named Papa. Though, well, through this meeting, <laughs> Matt finds important truths that would transform his understanding of his tragedy and change his life forever. Now, friends, this is a faith classic okay let me tell y'all y'all need to have this film on you all shelf you don't hear me say that a lot i mean i probably do say that quite a bit on this channel but <laughs> but this is what we do here right i so enjoy this film this film goes to that those deep places y'all like them hard places like y'all know those questions that it's like okay why what is the point of even asking this okay why do bad things happen to good people and why does god allow this or that i mean the, it's just an endless um stray of questions that we can all um have for god and we just don't understand being human beings and being so limited into what we see before us and our only understanding based on the experiences that we have had so i love this film because it does take us through these well to these deep places that this character mac has been through he has had a difficult time from his childhood i mean being abused by his father seeing his father abuse his mother all kind of different things like that y'all and he grows up like this so he's dealing with a lot of hard things and of course he ends up getting married have a family of his own and then a very horrible thing happened to him y'all like a tragedy happens that most people do not get past and it's understandable i can understand that i mean oh my goodness i don't even want to imagine being in a situation like mac here in this film but i i was here for the ride y'all and <laughs> and i had to just face it okay for y'all sake okay just let y'all know as well this movie is amazing it is based off a book the um, book I have heard was amazing, so I haven't read it, but the film definitely does, it just has it all for me, and it just really just captivates me. Um, the quality of the film is amazing. The characters here, Mac, his wife, the children here in this film, Papa, um, Jesus Christ here, even um, Holy Spirit. I mean, there's so many different things that just point you back to the Word of God, y'all, that y'all gonna be like, especially if you already in your Word, you have some history, some biblical history, some kind of understanding of God or Jesus. This is like, you're gonna love this. This is gonna be icing on the cake for y'all. It's just gonna have it all. You're gonna be like, oh my goodness. I, so many different scriptures gonna be coming to your mind. You're gonna be like, oh wow, that's where it is from. Oh, that's where you put it from. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> it's gonna be like that for y'all. But for those of you who are new on a new journey, a new walk with God, I mean, welcome. I'm so happy you chose them, all right? But yes, this is definitely that film for you as well because it's gonna give you so much understanding of just how loving God is. And I know you hear people say that all the time. You hear people say that to the point where it can almost be like, you just like, okay, I get it. Yes, God loves me, all right? I mean, I, yes, okay, that's what everybody say. And you tend to take it like that. But in this film, it just really makes you just stop. Like, everything in your world just stop. And you just listen. You just like, wow, God, Jesus really does love me. Like, oh my goodness, just to take in that moment, that understanding, and just to feel this connection with him, which I promise you, he will meet you wherever you are. And this film definitely does open that door for you. So that's why I just love it, y'all. Y'all gotta have this on y'all shelf, okay? You gotta have this, y'all gotta watch this, all right? It is gonna be amazing. I don't even wanna really get into it because, y'all, this is a journey. Like, seriously, this film is a journey, like a, a spiritual journey that you're gonna walk through in your own pacing, your own timing, with God. I mean, he's gonna meet you right there, y'all. You're gonna be like, girl, I'm alive. You need to be on this 
yes, I didn't. Okay, but let me know in the comments how it go for you because I love to hear it, all right? But with that being said, we're going to go ahead and get into our script before I leave y'all for the day because, yes, y'all, I'll be over here talking all day when it be coming to Jesus and these films and stuff like that. But we coming out of John chapter 1, verse 1. And it reads, okay, fix this film so perfectly. Y'all going to know what I talk about. We got to go, oh, y'all watch it. Y'all got to watch it. Okay. <laughs> In the beginning was the word, and the word was with God, and the word was God. Child, as always, please remember little y'all thoughts, y'all prayers, your overall take in the comment section below. Y'all know we, we like to chat down there. Yeah. We got to catch up. Let's see what's going on in y'all world, okay? But until next time, may the Lord bless and keep you both now and forevermore. Yes.